T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. All three engines up and burning. And lift off, the final lift off of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. Having fired the imagination of a generation, a ship like no other, its place in history secured, the space shuttle pulls into port for the last time. It overwhelms you to think about how many people have in some way, shape, or form touched this program and this vehicle to get us to this point. And we, in a lot of ways, are the lucky ones that get to fly it, but we certainly not for one second take for granted the amount of effort that so many other people had to put into this. I think we'll look back on this as a kind of a new era in space exploration. When I came into the astronaut office, we had a space shuttle and we worked towards retiring that over the first decade of my career at NASA. Now we're in a time when we've got multiple vehicles under development, all flying really close together. So it's a great time to be in the astronaut office. It's a great time from a space exploration time frame just to see all that happening. And it's because of this nurturing of the environment, being able to pull in a wider group of people who can contribute toward human spaceflight. It's a super cool time. Ignition, lift off.